did. I did. The judge didn't do this. Right, you can see right. Mm -hmm. no. that, I don't understand, man. That's a unanimous decision right there. Straight up. I thought you were taking control in the second half. Yeah. Control my head. See what it is. Jab is just misunderstood. It's so old school. These people today just know tip your head and start fighting. Yeah. They want they want you boxers to compete with the MMA crowd. See how to make fights like an MMA fight. They want to see that. They want to do. Y'all just take your head and fight. So that, that, that's more exciting for them. Yeah, I mean, yeah, ain't nobody gonna submit themselves to that nonsense. Were you guys cognizant of the fact that he was kind of doing the, ten, the last 10 second thing and really? Yeah, well, yeah, we were. We but were. the judge is supposed to be aware of that too. Sure. Yeah. If you went around, you can't win around 10 seconds unless you do something clean enough. Yeah, so they gotta be there. I mean, that's old. That's that's old. Nobody, yeah. that ain't crafty no more. You know what I mean? Everybody's aware of that nonsense. He's a bigger man. I'm walking him down. Right. You know, it was back and forth, but I'm 203. You know, he's been a heavyweight for, you know, 10, 11, that's yes. his 11 heavyweight fight. He should be walking me down the whole fight. Wasn't that's happening. Right. You know, Adam is easy to beat. We showed you guys. You can do it with one arm, with a jab. You know, and, and some right hands. But he's a tough guy. Don't get me wrong, but he, he he's beatable. He's been beaten. He's gotten he's gotten these gifts over and over. So, I mean, well, what else you got to do but knock him out? And everybody's not, you know, we can't all. If that was that simple, it'd be done. It's not that simple. The jab was key. The jab was key. Body shots and, and, and key right hands. I had him, I stunned him a few times. And it's just being smart. The defense, the jab, and just being smart behind the defense and jab. There you have it, a victory. But I just don't understand. That's, that should be my heavyweight title. It's unbelievable, man. It's unbelievable. Something needs to be done about stuff like this. I'm going tell you, don't, don't get excited because, like I said, I can't, I can't believe that that's just over like that. So I'm just going to hold firm for a second because I don't believe something like that, something won't be done behind something. That's like ridiculous, that. man. So we just, we just sit back. And, and, and make the motions we have to make. I mean, we're waiting John to be in here in a second, and we go from there. The world saw it, That's the or best. America saw what happened. You know, um, this is why boxing isn't on network TV, um, you know what I mean, for, for a lot. Because stuff like this happened. The right guy's not winning, you know? It's ridiculous. And what, now where do I go? Square one, square two? I should be, I should be whatever, IBF Intercontinental champ, heavyweight champ, but you know. We'll see. I believe we executed our game plan. I mean, you can ask the trainer, but I, I felt I executed the game plan and gave a little bit of the old fight, just a little bit. You know, um, he's a bigger guy. He did try to force his wheel on me, but we got caught him with some good shots coming in. Good right hands, good left, a couple good left hooks. I feel we, we executed the game plan, and the game plan always changes, and we adapted, you know, and I feel we were successful. I give that dude no more than three rounds. Because I'm looking at jelly. It's chilly in here, too. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to get dressed. Did he hurt you at any point? No. Did I look? Did, I mean, did I look hurt at any point? He caught me with a few, you know, a few good shots. But the, you know, the championship level I, fight. exactly. It's a championship level fight. I'm an elite fighter. Um, we worked through it. If I did, but I didn't get hurt. You know, he, some shots grazed my hand. My defense was right. You know, my defense was right. So that's for the fans to see, the world, America to say, you know what happened because I did my job. You get the backlash. Right? My job was to win, and I felt that I did that straight up. We had a great camp, I had a great, wonderful team, job, and, and we did our job. Judges didn't do their job, and, and we won that fight. America sees it, y'all call it for what it is, I'm gonna just shut up <laughs> and get dressed. Tamaz Adamek, congratulations on your win. My name is Jason Colon from, from ThePugilistReport.com. Tell me, how are you feeling right now? I'm feeling, I'm feeling good, you know, I'm not tired because uh, there wasn't many punches. Uh, the fight uh, was... Interesting people said, uh, I have to look, look at it, what's going to happen uh, for rounds. But there was a lot of punches, many punches from my, my side. But Steve's tactic was run. He ran, sometimes people uh, pissed on the fight. Mm -hmm. That was how uh, it was. You know? But uh, Roger said uh, after eight rounds, let's go forward to him. He had to uh, drop him uh, because, you know, uh, the scorecard. Uh, it's close. Speaking of the scorecard, I mean, Steve Cunningham's um, corner and Steve are, are a little bit bothered about the scorecard, saying that it was all wrong. Can, give me your thoughts on that. You know, it's, I, I never uh, can say nothing to the scorecard because I'm a referee. Uh, not the referee. 
discussion the referee. Yeah, the, 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 the most important is I win. The, the people was fan was happy in TV. Uh, I win this fight. Now, compare this fight to the first fight that you had with Steve Cunningham. What did you see different from this fight? In the first fight, you know, I got more, more punches. I'm sure. Yeah. Uh, this fight, I didn't feel nothing. I got not too many punches. Uh, it was more, more punches. I was more square. You know, uh, my, there was different fight than, than, than this fight. And Steve was stand more front to me. Mm -hmm. uh, first fight, but this fight he ran much. What do you say, uh, were you searching for a knockdown for him? Were you searching yeah, I, to knock him down? Uh, I don't remember which one, you know, twice. I think uh, that was a couple of seconds. I hit him, he grabbed him. The knife was gone. Uh, this is, you know, this is uh, the box, you know. He was smart, grabbed me. But, you know, uh, he fell, I'm sure he fell many, many of my right hand punches. But he's a tough boy. Uh, he's smart. Smart as in moving around and, you know, just. That was his tactic, you know, uh, coach tactic, and uh, he can stand in front of me and fight because uh, I'm uh, a little bit longer and heavy, and I can uh, I could hit him and drop him. You felt like you could have dropped him, but he just kept on but moving that around. Clean, that was clean, and uh, he not fell down, and uh, this, this top boy, uh, like my good children. In one of the rounds, I'm not sure if I can recall it, maybe it was the seventh or sixth round, he hit you with the right hook that almost got you down no, or no, off balance. No, 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 no. I did this in nothing in four rounds. So that not at all. Maybe maybe a slipper on my on my foot, but not. Uh, maybe lost your balance no, a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I lost balance, but not uh, no. But none of I none of his not, punches hurt not, you at all. He's no puncher. You know, he's, he's not a puncher. He's not a puncher, but he's not a puncher. He's not a puncher fighter. He's a puncher, but he's not the no. type of puncher that can hurt you. Nothing. No. Nothing. The performance was good. We trained very hard eight weeks between the training with Russia. Two weeks in my home. I was ready for the fight. Uh, Steve took tactics. Uh, run. She ran much. Thank you. Good to see you again. Thank you. <laughs> Yeah. Too much run, you know, and that was six tactic. I, I, I have to attack him, and I did. What did you feel was the biggest difference between the first fight and the second fight tonight? You know, I uh, I don't get many punches in this fight. I may hit me a couple times, but I didn't feel nothing. You know? That uh, this is different, and I have to look, you know. Uh, the tape, how many punches was, how many punches I got, I got hit. But you know, the best, uh, the most important is I win this fight and uh, my career going up. I got many hard punches, right hand, many right hands. He grabbed me many times in uh, the last uh, couple of seconds. With, uh, I see nine rounds. That was interesting, good fight, with many punches too. I won this fight, uh, the fight was very really close. Thank you very much. Thank you. But you know, I hit him more. I, I don't know how many punches. Uh, I'm, um, I'm sure. That, um, you know, I hit and how many punches I gave. I gave him. But you know, the most important is I win. You know, uh, I thought the, the fight can be a more open fight. You know, more interesting for, it, for fans. But uh, his tactic was the run. You know, uh, was. Are you happy with the judges' scorecard? Yeah, I'm happy because I win this fight and. Uh, I made the next step in, the, in my career. And, uh, I'm going. Uh, what is to be expected of you for 2013? You know, every fighter um, fighting uh, get title fights again. Uh, uh, I, I will have, uh, I don't know how many fights, one, maybe two, and uh, I should get title fights again. On behalf of the pugilistreport.com, we want to thank you for an outstanding performance, and we wish you much luck and success on 2013. Happy New Year to you. Thank you very much. See you next time. <laughs>